everyone welcome back to tech Labs, another tutorial you know to install the latest version of microsoft windows operating system windows 11 we need to enable ufi bios and secure boot in this video we will check if our system bios ufi and secure boot are already enabled if not we will change the settings from bios to make it work for windows 11. <music> Your motherboard must support UFI BIOS and Secure Boot. Let's check it. Okay, we go to the search box and we will type MS. Okay, click System Information. Now in the System Summary section, look for BIOS mode. You can see my BIOS mode is UFI, so I don't need to change. If you see here Legacy mode, then you have to change it. Now find the Secure Boot state. This one. If it's enabled on BIOS, you will see like this and you don't have to do anything if it shows on so if your secure boot is not enabled from bios you need to change the settings from bios as well to do this we'll have to restart our pc and enter into bios you know how to enter bios just look at your screen while booting and you will see which key to press to enter bios in most cases f2 keys are used for entering BIOS. Now I will show some snaps from HP laptop BIOS. Let me show you. Okay, this one. In most cases, you'll find the settings in boot options. Then you change the BIOS mode from legacy to UFI and in secure boot control enable it. Just that. In HP laptop BIOS, you will see in the advanced section, click on here then you will find this menu options you will see that configure legacy support and secure boot and then you just select this one legacy support disable and secure boot enable just that then you just save and exit from bios and your bios mode and secure boot are enabled now so that's pretty much of it thanks for watching see you in the next video